A teenager's disappearance has her family and some community leaders concerned. It's now been almost four weeks since she was last seen. KCRA3's Maricela de la Cruz spoke to the missing girl's mother, and she has more on what they're asking law enforcement to do. Nearly a month after 16-year-old Nikari Johnson's disappearance, she could be your daughter. Loved ones are searching for Johnson one flyer at a time. It's a dead end. So that what worries me the most because somebody should have spoken to her by now. Family members and advocates showed up outside the Sacramento County Sheriff's Office to demand a search for their loved one. A spokesperson with the Sacramento County Sheriff's Office tells KCRA that Johnson does not meet the criteria for an adverse juvenile. Causing some community leaders to question whether the lack of action is related to race. When it comes to black girls, we have absolutely no sense of urgency to pick up and figure it out and find them. Johnson was last seen on December 27th and is said to have left on her own, causing concern after leaving without her cell phone, money or extra clothing. We have a long way to go for progress in America. We can start here in Sacramento. Thank you. According to the National Missing and Unidentified Person System database, about 38 percent of people who go missing in the country are black more than double their percentage in population. People of color are routinely dis discounted in searches in missing persons, especially teenagers, especially girls. A spokesperson with the Sacramento County Sheriff's Office told me over the phone that the 16-year-old is not considered at risk, but couldn't tell us whether they have been able to make contact with her to determine that information. In Carmichael, Maricela de la Cruz, KCRA 3 News. So she is described as four foot nine. She weighs about 108 pounds. The last time she was seen, she was wearing a black hoodie and white tennis shoes.